Hello, and welcome to the Ed Hoddle Show. I'm Greg Royce, joined here with Stevenson head football coach Ed Hoddle. And coach, you guys went up to FDU Florham last week, um, overcame a little bit of a slow start to pick up a convincing 52-14 win. Uh, just talk a little bit about the victory. Uh, it was a good win for us. Um, you're right, though. It was a little bit of a slow start. Um, you know, we've got to do a better job being focused and coming out of the gate with a little bit more intensity. And, and, and again, we're looking for that solid 60-minute performance that I don't think we've put on film yet this year. Yeah. Um, one highlight from last week, Preston Addo, uh, three touchdowns, two receptions from Dan Williams, and then a punt return for touchdown, the second of his career. Um, got Max Special Teams Player of the Week and was also honored by D3Football.com. Just talk about his week and uh, his performance on Saturday. Uh, Preston did an outstanding job, um, both on on offense and special teams, and he's a guy that we look for, you know, regularly for explosive plays. Um, we try to work to get him the football as often as possible um, because he can generate those types of plays. And you know, he he works really really hard in practice, and you can see him getting better as the week goes on with with new schemes and things like that. So, um, you know, his progress as a player has been quite remarkable to watch, and and I think he still has a lot of good football left. Yeah. Um, speaking of Dan Williams, uh, he set a couple of program records, uh, completions and passing yards on Saturday. Um, just talk about his performance through the first three games. Uh, we, we're very excited with where Dan is and, and where we think Dan can still go. Um, he, you know, he's impressive from the perspective of how he prepares for Saturdays. Um, spends a great deal of time in the office on Mondays, helping us develop the game plan, and you know, we get his input. and And it's a quite a unique relationship between him and Coach Larson, and one that that so far this year has, has proven itself to be very valuable on Saturdays. Yeah, and defensively, uh, just one you know defensive touchdown given up, and that was on the short field. Um, you know, for the second straight week, they just gave up seven. Talk about their effort over the last couple of games. Um, you know, the scheme's coming together. The guys are starting to gel a little bit. Um, we really want to look at those at those touchdowns, though. You know, from from our perspective, you know, giving up a turnover, and then you know we've got to take take the field on the short field and, and be able to execute the defense at a very very high level and keep our opponents out of the end zone. So that's been a bit of a point of emphasis this week. Yeah, I think one guy that's flown a little, a little bit under the radar is uh, DJ Brox, and he's been all over the field. You know, breaking up passes, had an interception in the end zone on Saturday. Um, he's kind of stepped in for those guys in the backfield that you lost. He's coming around nicely. He, um, you know, he's been in the program now a couple of years, and, and he's really kind of growing into his own. And uh, you know, we're excited for him. He, you know, he's another one of those guys that, you know, the more reps he gets in game, the better player he we feel like he can be. And you know, he, not having an opportunity to play a great deal over the last couple of seasons is, um, you know, as much as it was a gift at that point, it's now we're trying to catch some guys up from right. from a game rep experience perspective. Yeah. Now this week you hit the road again. You head up to uh, Delaware Valley. Obviously, you know, big game. Um, they're all big, but obviously, you know, this one you know, could have impact on the final standings. Um, what's the mindset going in? Uh, the focus is on us. You know, how, how can we get to a point where we play our best football of the year on Saturday afternoon? And we feel like we control so much of, of how we perform on Saturdays and, and how we mentally prepare, how we physically prepare, and how we practice. And the emphasis this week has been very, very simple. All of these things are geared toward one thing, and that's, that's winning one football game on Saturday afternoon. Yeah. Well, Coach, best of luck on Saturday. We'll see you up there. Um, for Ed Hoddle, I'm Greg Royce, and this has been the Ed Hoddle Show.